The Washington Post this weekend reported that there was administration contacts with the chairs of both the House and Senate Intelligence Committee. Specifically, and I'm quoting from the story, to asking them to contact the media to challenge stories about alleged contacts between members of President Trump's campaign team and Russian intelligence operators. In other words, the administration asked the chairs of both the House and Senate Intelligence Committees to contact media and knock that story down. Both chairs have acknowledged that they did have contact. I, I guess the first thing I just want to ask, as a member of the Senate Intelligence Committee, has anyone from the administration contacted you asking you to speak out on, on the issue? No, no, they haven't. And, and the second point is I read the same story. I haven't had a chance to talk to Senator Burr about it since it broke. I'll ask him about it when I see him and kind of get more detail about it. Would it be appropriate I think anything, to do that? Well, I need to hear, you know, I don't want to go just based off a, a news article. Let me just say this, though. I think it's very important that the work of the Senate Intelligence Committee be 100 percent credible, that when we issue our report, everyone on both sides of the aisle looks at it and says this was a serious effort, free from politics, in which no one, Democrats didn't try to make it more spectacular than it was for political purposes, Republicans didn't try to cover something up for political purposes. I will not sign my name to a document or a report. I will not vote for a report that has been interfered with politically by either side of this equation. I have grown up in a community surrounded by exiles who suffered at the hands of communists. The notion that a KGB agent who is now the president of Russia is meddling in our democracy is deeply offensive to me. And I want the American people to be aware of it, if that's what's happened, why it happened, how it happened, and what we can do about it. That's what I'm prepared to be supportive of. If our, and that's what I believe our committee is going to do. I really do. If it does not, I will be the first person out there telling everyone this is not a credible report because it was interfered with politically from the left or from the right. But, but that to me is the number one priority.